Hey, how are you? My name is Amber, and I'm going to be your nurse today. So today, your doctor ordered you to get a nasogastric tube, and I'm just going to confirm that order by having you state your first and last name for me and also your date of birth. All right, Ms. Johnson, do you have any allergies or anything like that? No? Okay, that's great. So like I said, your doctor ordered you a nasogastric tube, and it's just going to go into your nose and through your stomach. Just so you can get your food properly because you've been having trouble swallowing recently. It shouldn't cause you too much pain or discomfort, but if you do experience any of that, just let me know and then I'll stop. And we can start back up. I'm just going to place this towel on you. Just in case if you spit or gag or anything, you can just land on that towel. Alright, and then I'm just going to get started. My tape is already torn and measured. Starting at your nose, down to your earlobe, into your xiphoid process. Just gonna lay that there. And can you breathe out this nostril for me and out the other one? So which one would you like to have it inserted in? This one? Okay. So we're just going to begin. I just need you to hold your head back. I'm just going to insert it. Okay. Now that's in your larynx, I'm just going to have you put your chin to your chest for me. I see that you're gagging, so I'm just going to stop the placement for a moment and just give you some ice chips. And you can just swallow those just to help the tube go down even easier. And we're almost done. Okay, great. So now I'm just going to secure the tube by taping it onto your nose. Ms. Johnson and now that the tube is secured I'm just going to send you down to x-ray so that they can confirm the placement of the NG tube just to make sure it's in your stomach before we start your feeding and everything and I'll be back hi Ms. Johnson so x-ray did confirm the placement of your NG tube so we're just going to start your feeding but before I do that I'm going to remove your wire from your tube start your feeding and then after the feeding the doctor has ordered the removal of the tube so I'm just going to start that by checking the bowel signs sounds of the patient bowel sounds are good and then I'm going to flush the tube with 10 milliliters of saline solution and now I'm just going to remove it so Ms. Johnson I'm just going to remove the tape off your nose and then can I just have you breathe in for me and then let it out. Okay, great, Ms. Johnson, that's it. And I hope you have a great day.